Yo, what's going on everybody and welcome to Don't Let Him In. My friends and I are headed to a concert when a strange old man stops us and asks if he can catch a ride with us and then some seriously strange shit starts happening. Oh, and just a really quick trigger warning, there is some sexual assault that's implied. You don't see it, but it is very heavily implied, so that's a thing. Anyways, as always, if you do enjoy the video, make sure to like and subscribe and welcome to the full gameplay of Don't Let Him In. I don't know about this. Hitchhiking can be dangerous. What if he's a criminal? Come on, Todd. We can't judge everyone based on appearances. Besides, we're all in this together. We'll be fine. Yeah, there's three of us. What are you gonna do? All right, fine. Let's pick him up. We're gonna keep a close eye on him. Click to pick up a hitchhiker. Okay, so I'm gonna place a prediction. Iba the hitchhiker is a bald man. Let's see, what do we get? Okay, we're stopping to pick him up right now. Where is he? So, uh, guy, where are you headed? Okay, okay, he's got some stubble. But, uh, maybe he doesn't, actually. Maybe he doesn't. Just trying to get to the next town over. I've got some business to take care of there. And what kind of business would that be? Just some personal stuff. Nothing to worry about. Well, we're headed to a concert. You're welcome to join us if you want. No, thank you. Thanks for the offer, though. Hey, uh, guys, I don't know if it's just me, but that gas station gave me the creeps. I don't remember seeing a cashier. I just left the money on the counter. Really? That's odd. I didn't notice anything out of the ordinary. Me neither. Yeah, maybe you're right. I just had a feeling that something wasn't right. Gas stations can be creepy places, especially when they're empty. But don't worry, you're all safe with me around. Hey, have you guys heard about this storm that's supposed to hit tonight? No, what storm? I heard it's gonna be a doozy, but it won't stop you guys from seeing that killer band, right? Definitely not. Not a chance in hell. You know, I've seen some strange things on this road. Things that make me question myself. What do you mean? I don't want to talk about it. I just want to get to the next stop. I fear for my life. Are you okay? You're starting to sound paranoid. No response. Oh wait, he didn't respond. Okay. Dude, relax. We've been driving for hours and we haven't seen anything strange yet. At least we picked you up. <laughs> oh, sorry, bad joke. That's weird. So, uh, where are we driving him out? Oh, bad. All right. I think we've been driving for a while now. Anyway, it's starting to get a little creeped out. Yeah, I've got a bad feeling about this. Why does it feel like we're just driving in circles? I don't know. I know. It's starting to freak me out. What do you think about the hitchhiker we picked up? <laughs> I don't know. He seemed normal enough when we picked him up, and now he's just staring out the window and not saying a word. Is he not right there? Can he not hear them talking? Do you ever feel like you're trapped? Like, no matter what you do, you can't get out? He speaks, but seriously, man, what are you talking about? I know you're scared. You're all scared, but there's no need to be afraid. What are you talking about? Your fears and doubts, things to keep you up at night. I can help you break free. <sighs> How are you gonna do that? By showing you the truth. I don't like this. Let's just drop him off. Please, sir, get out. It's too late. You're all trapped and there's no way out. Oh my god, what just happened? Did he really just kill himself? I can't believe this is happening! Why did we pick him up? Why did we let him into our car? <laughs> we have to try and stay calm. I just need to figure out what's going on and how to get out of here. It's gonna be okay. We'll find a police station nearby and tell them what happened. Oh my god, my dad's gonna fucking kill me. The car, what if they think we had something to fucking do with this? <laughs> I think he was trying to tell us something. I think he's just fucking crazy. We have to keep going or we're gonna miss the band. The band? Who gives a crap about the band? Fuck you, Todd. Fuck you, Tyler. Hey, chill. Don't touch his gun. I'm gonna go into the diner and see if I can find some help. Wow. Didn't expect that one. You guys coming or what? I'll wait here. Something about this place gives me the creeps. Me too. I'll keep the hitchhiker company. Fuck you, Tyler. Fuck you, Todd. We both quit it. All right, I'll go in by myself then. I can't even remember what my own voice sounds like. 
Jesus, man, that was crazy. Okay, so I'm going in by myself. That guy's, what are they drink, uh, drinking and smoking? You guys are so stupid, you know that? Such morons, man. Okay, into the diner we go. We got a sanity. Hello? Hey, uh, James and Todd, you guys wanna come in? now? actually, I'm kinda scared. A flashlight, I need that, it's really dark. Yeah, let's pick that up. Nice. And just like that, the whole entire place is illuminated. A map of the area, this road is highlighted. There's a small note. SOS, my family and I have been stuck on this road for three days. Food is spoiled, rations low. This isn't good. However, I better keep looking for help. Okay, is anybody at the diner? Okay, bathroom's occupado, I understand. I'll walk around then. Phone seems to be broken. Sanity is dropping rapidly. If I can find the right tool, I bet I can get this open. Look at, look at, okay, sanity feels nice. Wait, why is, why is my sanity tanking like that? What's even happening that's making me like this? So we, we need to find a tool and we need to find a tool immediately. Uh, okay, there's no more sanity pills right there, but I'm not gonna take those yet because my sanity's relatively high right now. Uh, I bet the tool is probably in the bathroom, which is really unlucky because I didn't want to go in here. You good in there, man? Something in this hole. <laughs> Disgusting, but I better look inside. Oh my god, it's a driver's license. An ID card. It looks like the guy we picked up. The card, it's pretty beat. I can't tell for sure. I think I can slide open the kitchen door with this. No, oh, nice. We're gonna use that as a... Um, a lock pick mechanism. The classic card in the door. Who the fuck is that? Jesus Christ. Give me those pills, bitch. Okay, so there's plenty of sanity pills, it seems, which is good. My sanity seems to be having a hard time. Okay. A strange symbol written on the wall. What the hell? I don't know, man. Let's see. And that's just it. Nothing else? Nothing's in here. There's some shit. I don't think we can eat or drink any of that. Maybe we can. I don't know. I don't know what that is, but it looks consumable. I've got to get out of here and back to the car. Okay, let's we'll take the key first. Nice. We got the diner key. And fuck the shit. I'm out of here. Goodbye. Boys! That was crazy! Holy, man. This game is a trip already. We just barely get got started. See anybody? A phone, perhaps? Nah, not a working one, but I saw something strange. I don't know what it means, though. Okay, genius. We should probably go. What about him? We can't just leave him here. Right, we'll have to bring him with us, but we need to hurry. Shotgun! Fuck you, man. I had to ride down with a guy. It's your turn. Shit, all right. Valid point. And there's blood on the car. This is so creepy. He's just sitting there staring at us. I know. I can't bear to look at him. Just try not to think about it. Look, there's that motel up ahead, James. You should go check it out. Are you sure that's a good idea? What about the dead guy in our car? I'm aware of the situation, Tyler, but I have to look for help. Um, yeah, what about the dead guy in the car? I'd probably get him out of the... Actually, I don't know what I would do here. Okay, I'll go talk to these guys. You guys keep jerking off. The guests are still here. Hey, we need help! Hello? Shit. With the radio, maybe I can tune it into channel 7. Can't take it anymore. The road goes on forever and there's no escape. I thought I saw someone up ahead. When I got closer, they disappeared. Am I losing my mind? Yeah. Uh, 
employee lounge. I think I can get in here if I can find the key. The key's probably gotta be back here somewhere, right? If that was a key. Maybe maybe behind like this painting or something? The guests are still here. In the cash, reg cash register? No. Maybe behind the couch. Not behind the couch, not behind the chairs. Come on, man. Where are you guys at in the key at? Maybe in this car, behind the car? No? Where then? Perhaps in the plant. Not in the plant either. This thing's just closed. Maybe. Okay, the stairs are blocked, so not up the stairs. Where is the key then? Oh, shit. Hello! Is anyone there? This is an emergency! Strange. I thought I heard something. Better come back and check this room out a bit later. Okay. I need to find the key, though, man, and I cannot find it anywhere. So it looks like we can actually go inside of some of these doors. I keep hearing whispers in my ear. When I turn around, there's no one there. I can't tell if it's my imagination or something else. I don't know how much longer I can take this. Much longer I can take it either. What is on this TV? It's green. Very green. Huh. Hello? This place is really filthy. It's like no one's been here for a long time. Or they don't have a maid. Key to room four. Okay, where was that at? Oh, right there. Okay, so we got the key to room four. That wasn't in room four, was it? <laughs> it sure was. Ah, <laughs> uh, hello! I heard some thing in here. Hello! <laughs> what? I tried to leave this in this room by walking through the woods, but it just let me back here. It's like there's no escape. I'm starting to think I'm in some kind of hell. Key to room five. Wait. Was I just seeing things? Was that not actually happening? Okay. Uh, that's interesting. I could have sworn I seen something. All right, this is a blue TV screen. Okay. Oh, nice, man. I can feel their hands on me, pulling me down, dragging me into the darkness. Uh, hey kid, what happened to you? Jeez, man, get it together, James. I swear, I, I, I just... Employee lounge key, nice. <sighs> Might be worth checking out. All right, let's take some pills. Grab the key, and we'll head back to the employee lounge. I gotta get this shit out of my head, man. I'm seeing things, it's not good for me. Let's get back to the lounge, and uh, hopefully we can phone a friend or something. Dude, go find some help. Check all the rooms. Fuck you, Tyler. Actual morons, man. Oh. <laughs> Bro, you better kick him in the fucking head. Okay, it wasn't real. I, I don't know why I'm seeing things right now. This is crazy. Key to room one. Huh. What's in here? This is just locked. Okay, so the employee lounge had nothing but a key to room one. Right. Okay, room one. We got some blood on the thing and an unmarked videotape. What are we going to be on there? Seems there's no tape player around. I should probably take this. Yeah, probably. I guess. Oh, my God. Hello! And nobody is in here. Okay, so let's go see now then if uh, one of these rooms that we went into had a tape player so we can watch the tape. See what's going on here. That one's still closed for maintenance. Do not enter. No tape player here. Uh, maybe I, I just could take the boys here. They think. Please, man. Go, maybe go in there. Go see if you can find anybody. Okay, so I'm still not done. Okay. Right, so I actually have to play this tape or something. If we want to move on. Can't play it in there. And... Oh, strange. It's a symbol I saw at the diner. And it's open now. And there's our tape player. Video cassette player. Maybe I should watch the tape I found in the other room. 
I guess. I can't escape my own mind streams. This is the only way I can show you how. What the hell? He was here. I saw him. Can't watch the escape here. I got. I gotta get back to my friends. Jesus Christ, man. We need to find some sanity pills is what we actually need to do. Grab some in here. No sanity pills in here. Yikes. I'm in trouble. Okay. Yeah, we need to get back to the boys and see if they have any ideas. I'm sure they will because they're so smart. All right, dickheads. Wow. Okay. Well, there was the motel. That was good. Really got a lot of intel from there. Dude, are you okay? I heard you screaming from inside. I don't know. I thought I saw the hitchhiker, but I'm probably seeing things. I have a really bad feeling about this place, man. That's it. We have to get this body out of here. It smells horrible. I think he shit himself. Okay, but then we have to get out of here. What are we going to do with the body, man? All right. Who's going to move it? But James, what are we get caught? We in a world of trouble. I agree with Todd. We can't just leave the body here. It's not right. Exactly, Tyler. We have to do the right thing. We can't just leave this poor guy on the side of the road. But what if the police stop and find the body in the car? We'll just have to take the risk. It's better than leaving him in the car with us. Actually, I think Tyler's right. We should move the body and then call the police to report it. All right, Tyler. Do it quickly and let's get out of here before anyone sees us. I'm sorry, uh, hitchhiker guy. Is he gonna move, he's moving out of the car. Come on, start already. Maybe it's just a dead battery. Or maybe it's something more serious. We need to figure this out quickly. He warned us about this storm, and we don't want to be stuck here. Yeah, I'll get out and take a look. Oh, okay. So now my playing is Todd. Pretty sure Todd can get our car running again. He always has been good at fixing things. I don't know, man. Todd's never really worked on a car before. I don't think he has the skills to fix whatever's wrong with it. Well, it might be right, Tyler, but at least we can give him a chance. We don't have many options right now. I can hear you. You're getting really cold. What's on your mind, man? You look like you've seen a ghost. Actually, I haven't seen this dead hitchhiker, like, moving around. First at the diner and now the motel. Ah. Uh, what is it, Tyler? I know I like to joke around, but I've been seeing him, too. I knew I wasn't crazy, but what does it mean? Why are we both seeing him? Not sure, but I think it has to do with our hitchhiker friend. Also, you notice how the roads seem to be looped back around? It's like we can never get past the same spot. Gas station, motel, and diner. It's like we're stuck, just like he said. All right, I should do it. Do you guys want to get inside and try to start it again? Okay, hot shot. Oh. Woo! Yes, Todd. Well done, Todd. I gotta hand it to you. You're not a useless piece of garbage after all. Now can we all get out of here? What's that noise? Hey! Oh my god. No, 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 no. Todd, Todd, Todd. Oh my god, what just happened? I can't believe this. Get in the car, Tyler. We need to get out of here. What about Todd? I'm so sorry, buddy. Jesus, fuck. What do we do? <laughs> I, I didn't mean how to treat him like... Dude, he knows you love him. We need to get out of here before anything else happens. But what about the hitchhiker? Where did he go? Who cares about him? I can't believe Todd is fucking dead, man. We have to get out of here, Tyler. Holy shit. Dude, you haven't said a word. What do you want me to say? Something, anything. I can't believe this happened, man. I just can't believe it. I know, Ty. It started to make sense of something like this. And now I keep seeing my brother Danny. I know he's not really here, but I can't shake the feeling that he's with me. <laughs> you know, Danny drowned in the lake near our house when we were kids. That hitchhiker now, Todd, they're in my head. You're not alone, man. We'll get through this together, but I'm really worried for you. Danny, my baby brother was just starting, was just staring at me through the water. Even though he was lifeless, he had, look, he had a look on his face as if he wanted to kill me. 
Try to calm down. It's okay, man. You're just shaking up. We'll be out of the gas station soon and we can get some gas. Wait. Did you say the gas station? Yeah, we're running pretty low on gas. We need to stop and refuel. You mean the gas station where this mess started? Yeah, but what can we do, man? Todd got the car. We're going to need to use it to get away from here. That's close to where we picked up that fucking guy. Dude, the light is on. I guess you're right. Let's just get this over with. Oh. Hey, man. I'm going to grab some supplies. Is that okay with you? I don't know, James. It could be risky. We need to get food, batteries. We can't keep driving forever without stopping. God, okay, fine. But let's make it quick. I don't like this feeling of being exposed like this. That guy came back, could come back any second. I hear you, man. <sighs> Not Tyler being stuck with me. He's just going to sit in the car and smoke a ciggy. All right, man. Right, so I'm guessing we got the car filled up. It's looking like shit. It's locked. That's strange. When I was here earlier, it wasn't locked. I need to find the key. Okay. The key. What's this? That's nothing. That's blocked off. Maybe in the ice thing. No. Not there either. Perhaps. That's also blocked off. It must be... Not in there. Okay. It's got to be around this side then. Oh, there's a bathroom right there. Perhaps it's in the bathroom? Oh, it's got to be in there. 100%. Jesus Christ, he's dead! What happened to his eyes? I'm so sorry, but I need that key. The hitchhiker. He's not just in my head anymore. He's real. Holy shit. All right, man. So, uh, we shouldn't have picked up that hitchhiker. That's what I'm starting to learn. Hey, I got the key, Tyler. I'll be right back. All right, man. What? The door was locked, and now it's just open? I don't want those sanity pills yet. That's weird. The money I left earlier is still here. Where is everybody? Take that money back. Shit, this place is pretty much empty. Better grab whatever I can. Looks like we got... I don't know what that is. Some sanity pills. Don't know what that is. Some soda. And... Any ice cream? No ice cream. God damn it. I really would have liked some ice cream. Anything behind the counter? Some cash. Bro, take that cash. Real talk. Okay. And then pretty much nothing. The video date player. I should watch that tape. I don't know if we should watch that tape, bro. I think that's... What's taking him so long? Wait, Todd. Hey. Todd? Is that really you? Yeah, it's me, man. I don't understand. The truck, it killed you. I know, but I wanted to talk to you to say goodbye. Why did you have to go, man? Why did this happen to you? I don't know, Ty. I really don't. But I want you to know that I love you and I'm proud of you. I miss you, Todd. I miss you so much. You know, Ty, to be completely honest, I actually never really liked you. What? Todd, why are you, what are you talking about? You always thought you were better than me, didn't you? You always looked down on me. No, dude, you're my friend. I never thought that. Don't lie to me, Ty. You always thought you were the smart one, the successful one. You always put yourself first. Todd, what's going on? Why are you saying these things? Because I want you to suffer, Ty. I want you to feel the pain I felt when I died. You were never a good friend of me, and now you're going to pay for it. Todd, please, this isn't you. You're not like this. Oh, but I am, Ty. I'm exactly like this, and now you're going to have to live with the guilt of knowing that you were a good friend of me. I can't take this, Todd. Please make it stop. Tyler, Tyler, we need to get out of here right now. What took you so long? In the motel, I found this tape. I thought it was just some random home movie, but it, it wasn't. Okay, who gives a shit? Dude, the tape was unlabeled. I couldn't tell what was on it until I got here and I used the VCR at the gas station. A young girl tied up. I, I, Tyler, the hitchhiker, he was doing it for fun, like a sick game. And the victim, she was screaming and begging him to stop, but the hitchhiker was just smiling. 
I didn't know what to do. I mean, there, there was no way to identify who the victim was. God knows how many tapes there are like this. There was a house. A house? Yeah, a blue house right at the beginning of the tape. There was only a few seconds of footage as it had been recorded over. There was only a few frames, but I think I could spot it out if I saw it. Dude, look! Over there! Back on that diner! Ugh. Hello! Hello! Requesting return transmission over! There's no use. Must be the walkie. The trees can interfere with the signal. I guess you're right, but something feels different about this place. Hmm. 12 o'clock! Hey, hey! Oh my god, are we glad to see you! Hey there, boys. What are you doing out here all alone? You gotta help us. We picked up a hitchhiker, but he, he killed himself. Our friend was hit by a truck. We've been driving, but it feels like we're getting nowhere. Whoa, whoa! Slow down. You boys been doing drugs tonight, perhaps? Slow down, Frank. Now that you mention it, we've been having some trouble with this road ourselves. We've been radioing in, but we can't get a signal. See, this is why I keep telling you the department needs to get some of those new cellular phones. Okay, Frank. See, you've been, <laughs> See, you've been having trouble with this road, too. Yeah, this is my first night working in this town, and it feels like we've been stuck out here for a while. But that's not the only weird thing that's been happening. I know what you mean. Actually, I recognize you. You're Tyler Franco, right? Uh, yeah. How did you know? Your brother went missing a decade ago, right? Danny. Went missing? He drowned, but I don't see how that... Tyler, listen. Uh, I don't know if we should be telling you this. Your brother didn't drown. He was abducted. But I saw him drown. I'm... I'm sorry, Tyler. We put countless resources towards investigating your brother's disappearance for years, but we'd never been able to find the guy who did it. We narrowed down the search, and we think it was the guy who ran the videotape store here in the town, but he had an alibi for that day. I hate that fucking guy. What a degenerate lowlife. Frank? Sorry. Yeah, sorry, kid. What happened to your brother was tragic. Did I dream that my brother drowned? I was so young, my parents, they withheld the truth from me this entire time. Did you say something about a hitchhiker? You won't believe us. It's just strange. The abductor's M.O. was to hitch rides with families, kill the parents, and take the children. Your brother's case was different in that he was lured away from a school by a stranger. However, in both cases, eyewitnesses claim to have seen a bald man roughly in his mid to late 30s. We have reason to believe that these cases are connected. I, I can't believe this. Why are you telling me this now? We needed to be sure, but listen, we need your help. James saw something, didn't you? Something that could be connected to Danny's disappearance. Yeah, I saw this terrible, horrible tape. It was hard to watch. A, a tape? What kind of tape? Oh, man, we gonna watch it? Oh, my God! What the hell is this? I've been a cop for 22 years. I've never seen anything like this. Frank, we need to act on this right away. This is sickening. So you said you picked up this guy? Does anyone recognize the location? Yeah, it's him, but I don't recognize the house. Maybe we can track down the girl in the video and see if she's still alive? Do you think this guy could have done this to my brother? Not sure, son. We need to put an APB on this guy and get Tyler and James to safety. Can we help you guys catch this guy? Absolutely not. We can't risk your safety, but we'll keep you updated on the investigation. You know what, guys? I think we need to destroy the tape. It's not worth risking our lives for. What are you talking about, Frank? Yeah, we have to find the hitchhiker. He's a danger to everyone. And what And what about my brother? He could still be out there. I'm sorry, Tyler, but we can't risk our lives for a lost cause. I'm sorry, but I have to tell you all something. What is it, Frank? Seriously, Frank? That hitchhiker. You shouldn't have picked him up. Wait, so you guys know each other? We all know of him. It's a small town and we have to stick together. What is he to you? What's his part in all this? He's cursed our town, trapping us inside. No matter how hard we try, we cannot leave. The road just leads us back here. He promised to free us all. All he needed was sacrifices, tokens, if you will. It's not what you think. We don't just kill people for no reason. We believe that by offering the right souls, we can bring about a new age of enlightenment. One where we are free. What? You're crazy. 
No, James, I'm not crazy. I'm enlightened. He appeared like a prophet. How else can you explain it? What the fuck are you talking about, Frank? Deputy, you know too much already. And you're not part of this. I'm sorry, but I have to do this. Is just fucking dead. Well, that was good. How do I know you're not involved too? How do I know I can trust you? Oh, Samantha's still alive. I swear to you, James, I had no idea about this Colt or Frank's involvement. I don't know what to think anymore. Everything that's been happening is just so insane. How could he kill Tyler like that? James, I never thought this would happen. Why did I take on this stupid assignment? Yeah, well, forgive me if I'm finding it difficult to trust people right now. So that little girl, do you have any idea where she could be? No, I don't. But that hitchhiker you mentioned, the one that... Yeah. Have you been seeing him in places where he shouldn't be? I remember this story we used to tell each other as kids. When I was a teenager, we heard stories about this phantom hitchhiker. We would like to say his name in mirrors and do all sorts of dumb stuff like that. I remember asking my parents and they told me it was all a hoax. Stranger danger stuff, basically. Oh, but they didn't tell me, although the Phantom Hitchhiker wasn't real, there were, in fact, real reports of children going missing a few towns over from where I live. My brother wouldn't sleep all night when they told him that story. Didn't Frank say something about a video store employee? Maybe there's a chance he could be the Hitchhiker? Me and Frank drove past the VHS store a few hours ago. I could probably take you there. However, James, I definitely know where the blue house in that film is. Really? Is that the blue house, or we're at the blue house now? This is the house on the tape, I'm sure of it. I'm, it was the first house I saw when I drove into town. I'm worried about you, Samantha, you should stay here. Save your strength. Are you sure you're okay? I'll be fine, James. I'm just glad I could take down Frank before he could hurt anyone else. What if something happens to you while I'm in there? Don't worry about me. You need to find out what's going on in that house. We need to stop this once and for all. Yeah, all right, I'll be quick. If anything happens, you honk the horn, I'll come running. Deal, but be careful, James. I have a bad feeling about this. I have a bad feeling about it, too. Bad feeling, I'm gonna... Okay. Here we go, into the house, and what the fuck is that? Is it a hitchhiker? Okay, but the door's just open. What is it? Oh, I got a bat now. So I'm about to beat some ass. Follow me for days now. I can hear his whispering voice. I see a shadowy figure lurking in every corner. Always watching, always waiting. I can't escape him no matter how hard I try. Not a problem, man. What the hell? Hey, new guy. You look lost. Yeah, I'm part of a different chapter of the organization. Good. You know, we down here have a special connection to the Hitchhiker. The Hitchhiker? Yeah. As you know, he goes by many names, but we all know who we're talking about. Some of the folks say he's as old as the time itself. Isn't it kick-ass, man? I mean, an actual godlike creature's among us. You said it. Amen, brother. So what do you guys do down here for him? A stranger you haven't been informed. Tapes? Ah, oh, yeah. The tapes. The hitchhiker needs him to sustain himself. And the more he has, the happier we keep him. It's important for us to keep him happy. If we do this, he leaves us alone for the most part. I've seen him a few times, though. I've seen him once. He talked to me. Where did you say you were from again? I sent something off about him. Wait a minute. You're not one of us, are you? What are you talking about? Of course I'm one of you. Prove it then. The hitchhiker and a broken clock. What do they both have in common? Well, uh, I don't know. You're not one of us. Get him! Oh, holy shit, how am I gonna win this fight, man? Oh, okay, one down. You fucked, idiot. Nice try. This guy's kind of, uh, sucked. 
Looks like this could be for the back door. Okay. A key. All right, so we kill. We just killed two cult members. Very casually, might I add. All right, we're in here. What the hell? I don't like this. Oh my god, another dead kid. Jesus. What's that noise? Uh, is it a door? A washing machine. There's a key in here. Looks like it's for the front door. Help me! The hell? Please, mister, kill me. Uh, my god, kid. He's dead. I have to get out of here. Oh shit, Samantha. What did he the we the key? Get the key. This is, we got the key. All right, let's uh let's get back. What did he say? The key looked like it was for what? The front door. This one. Okay, that's where I. Jesus Christ! Wait. Something about the way this is. It seems like a ritualistic killing. This is some fucked up place. Shit. I have to keep looking around. I think I've looked everywhere, basically, right? I mean, I saw all this. Oh, maybe I was supposed to see that earlier? I don't know. Let's go back and see if Samantha's okay. Samantha? I bet Samantha's dead. Samantha! Still here, James! Wait, where's her head at? I didn't see her head. I, th I thought her head was missing. Still there though. Fuck, fuck! Are he okay, Jims? What happened in there? I don't even know where to start. I, I just, I did some, I just did something terrible. What do you mean? What happened? I went into the blue house on the tape. I found two of those cult members. They were just standing there. I don't know what came over me, but I, I just, I attacked them. I killed them, Samantha. I actually killed them. Oh my God, James! I can't even imagine. But James, you have to understand. They were a danger to us. They were gonna hurt us or worse. You did what you had to do. But that's just it. I never thought I was capable of something like that. It's just, it's, it's like something took over me. When it was over, I saw a young boy dead. Another one asked me to kill him. I couldn't do it. I can't believe this road is so fucked up. I feel like I'm going crazy. It's okay, James. You're not crazy. This whole situation's crazy. Maybe we're all just trying to survive. And you did what you had to do. You protected us. That's all that matters now. I know you're right. It's just seeing that boy like that in the tape, I just can't get the image out of my head. I know, it's not easy, but we have to keep moving forward. We have to stay strong. I think we need to go to this video store. Okay, James, I'll try my best to lead you there. Oh, wow. We're here, Samantha. Good work. Ah, oh. Samantha. Oh my God, Samantha. I think she's still alive, barely. I have to be quick. No response. Okay, let's get into the VHS store and figure out what we have to figure out. Who is that? Another one of those cult members. What has he done to them? I have to be careful. What the fuck? Why is this uh, van's running too? Something feels off. The officer said the guy who works here could be involved in all this. But, like anybody that is in this town is involved in all this, right? Shotgun? Shotgun. I could really use this. Goddamn right, we can use it. Hell yeah. Okay. Damn, it's locked. I need to find the key. I mean, or we blow open one of these glass windows with a shotgun. Okay. So that's not gonna work. So I actually have to find the key. I feel like it would make total sense to just blow a window open, but whatever, I guess. That door's locked as well, it seems. Doesn't look like there's anything too exciting back here. Must be around this other side here. Let's see, what do we got? Huh. Weird. Also nothing on this side. Where are you bitches hiding the key to this thing, then? Well, maybe... Maybe back out here? Let's see, what's happening here? Broke down car. And then my car. Obviously, it's not in my car. That's as far out as I can walk. Samantha, how are you holding up? Just wanted to check in. 
Cool. Sounds good. Okay, so then where's the key? Oh. I just missed that, apparently. Okay, it's for the front door. Video central. I don't know how I didn't see that the first time, but... There it is. <sighs> Jack jacked. Hup goes to America. This is really strange. There's nothing new here. All the movies are at least four years old. Something's really off about this place. James, why are we still acting so stunned about everything, man? Obviously, there's something off about everything that's going on here. Another tape. Jesus, another one of those tapes. This has to be the right place. So we're not gonna watch that, right? What's going on on the TV up there? There's a cup of, cup of Joe. It seems to be brand new. Okay, let's go look and see what's happening on the TV, as bad as I don't want to. Who are you? What do you want? Those end up here have lost their way. Those who are searching for something but don't know what it is. And you, James, you are lost. How many have you taken? Oh, James, you have no idea. Todd, Tyler, Samantha. Oh, I knew you liked her. You couldn't save them. Poor, poor James. They had to make a deal. People in town knew it was the only way, but in return, I needed things. You sick fuck. I don't get it. Why well, record it on tape? The tape captures your fear, your pain, your suffering. The more tape in my possession, the more I promised I would keep the endless prison away. I guess this time they didn't meet my expectations. Now, James, this is where I need you. This is insane. I won't be part of this. You're already here. You were chosen to be on this road for a reason. And now, you have no choice. Fuck you. I thought you might say that. What the fuck? Oh, we having a shootout in the video store. Oh my god, shoot out the blockbuster! Y'all heard it here first, turn in! Tune in, not turn in, tune in! Where's he at? Bitch, where'd you go? Crusty old fuck, come on now. Pull up. Oh wait, did I kill him? I killed him. Nice try. Some god you are, eh? Jesus. There's the girl. Or maybe not the girl. Oh my god. Hi. Oh no, don't don't worry. I'm not going to hurt you. What's your name, little girl? Cassidy. Hi, Cassidy. My name's James. I'm here to help you. Please, you have to help me. He's hurt the others. He made us do bad things. Jesus. I'm so sorry, Cassidy. I promise you the hitchhiker won't hurt you anymore. Let's get you home. I have one last thing I need to do. What's that? Burn the shit to the ground. I know, Cassidy. That man was a demon. I'm sorry that he harmed you, but I promise you, he won't be able to hurt anyone else anymore. How did you find me, James? We actually didn't know if anyone was alive. I'm just glad I was able to find you. Now let's get you home safely. You've been through all this game. Sick tapes. I know it's all going up in flames. We also need to get Samantha to a hospital now. Damn. I don't know about this. Hitchhiker can be dangerous. What if he's a criminal? What's going on? Where are we? Why are you stopping? Let's pick up this guy and get going. Yeah, everything's fine. Don't worry about it. I was just overthinking it. But, Tyler, you were shot and Todd, you were hit by a truck. How are you here? The hell are you talking about, James? We're all here. We're fine. No, I'm sure of it. You guys were hurt. I saw it. James, we're fine. You're scaring me, man. Seriously, just calm down. Let's let him in. Must be cold. Hey, dude, over here, we'll give you a ride. No! Don't let him in the car. James, you're really scaring me. It's him. He killed both of you. Haha, <laughs> James, seriously. No, seriously, we need to go. What? Cassidy! Yes? Nothing. <laughs> Easy now. I never should have picked up that hitchhiker. Because of my actions, all my friends are dead. 
If I didn't face my fears and dance with the devil, they'd be dead like the others. How could I have known about this endless road? I always remember what happened here. Jesus, man, I was not expecting that. That was like a whole movie by at Johnny made it. Nice, dude. Well, that's really cool. Um, I like that. That was a, a lot of reading and I was not expecting that. I wasn't expecting to be, I don't know, basically reading the whole entire time, but I had a good time. I hope you all had a good time. And if you did have a good time, please make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel. Let me know in the comments what you thought about let him in or don't let him in, whatever it's called. I will have it linked in the description. Did I already say that? Go check it out. Uh, it doesn't look like really anybody's played this game yet, so go show this game some love. It was actually really good and really well. Oh, we're not done. I'm sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> okay, there it was. The ending of Don't Let Him In. Thanks for watching. Appreciate y'all. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.